Map Tracing is new to London 2012 Games. It's actually only got two boats in the race. Um, so unlike the other disciplines in sailing, it's one-on-one, -on -one, very intense. It's quick races and we could have 10 in one day. So 10, 20 minute races and, you know, they're, they're pretty hard work. Communication is a huge part of our sport because it's very action packed racing. There's a lot happening at once and, and things change, you know, in a split second. Some parts of our race will have all three of us talking at the same time, but, but actually that's what we need. Part of our communication work is trying to find key words that means that we don't need to say much at all. So we've got quite a complex structure really to it um, and we're trying to work hard on improving it every day really. The three of us are very different people and I think that's a really good thing because we need, need a little bit of everyone's personality really to produce the right team. Yeah. 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 We spend a lot of time together, we're obviously in a small boat together and if we're not in a small boat together we're probably on a plane together or in a car together going somewhere so it feels like we spend all our lives together really. Um. <laughs> It's been fantastic actually having Rhys on board and, and becoming more of a team of four than three. While on the water he's got a really good eye at, at seeing where we can improve. Um, he's also helped us I think off the water. He's got a love of the sport the same as us and he's able to, to help us really enjoy our training and our racing and, and realise that you know, we're very lucky to be in the position that we are. Yeah, Maurice is very experienced and he has a lot of good views really on how to approach success and failure. And he's certainly been very good at helping us to manage our own expectations. We had an interesting day when Finley came to take the pictures. He had the boat on the crane. Luckily, there was no wind. And with all the amazing lighting and yeah, and then we had to get a bit cold and wet in the water. <laughs> very cold. <laughs> But it was, yeah, amazing to watch. Like, we've never had anything like that, so it's really cool. It was really cool to see how he just took a bit of a blank canvas, really, and got an amazing portrait out of it. It's really exciting to be part of the National Portrait Gallery project. I think that sailing's, although one of our most successful Olympic sports, is not really a mainstream sport, and so it's really exciting to be involved with something with all the other athletes as well. We often feel quite out of it, actually, at the Olympics. We have a different venue and, you know, we have quite a different type of games, really, to everyone else, a long week, so it's nice to be in with all the other athletes. Our focus now is all about the Olympics, which are going to be held in Weymouth, and therefore we're basing nearly all of our training here when it's possible. It's a fantastic opportunity, having the games on, on home waters. And we all live, you know, just an hour away from where we'll be sailing in 2012, and, you know, it's just such an awesome opportunity that we don't want to let slip, you know, pass us by.